Hey, what's going on everyone? This is Ari Views back with another video and today I will share with you guys some really cool iPhone widgets. These are mostly new and you probably never knew about them and even if they are not new, they're not that popular. So not a lot of people actually know about these widgets. Now we have also a few interactive widgets, basically widgets that allow you to do more than just take place right there on the home screen. You can actually tap on them to do an action or reveal something which is actually a really really cool now before we get into all that just please make sure you go ahead and leave a like on this video and also do me a huge favor by subscribing to the channel because most of you guys that watch my videos are currently not subscribed so make sure you do that all right we're starting things off with icon themer now this is a newer app that has recently been released and it offers some really cool widgets and here we have three of those we have one right here for the volume we have right there seller data and the wi-fi we have one for the storage and one for the time right there going into the app right here we'll have a bunch of stuff you will even have like themes to download and things like that and if you go to the widget section right here we'll have clock so you can see different widgets for clocks you will have storage right here you will have like different neon widgets which are really cool you will have quotes you will have your settings right here and then you will have also some other widgets right here now once you want to go ahead and apply one of these widgets to your device just simply open it tap on set widget and just save it as new right here once you have done that you go to the home screen add the widget from this app and then you can simply 3d touch on that on that widget like this and of course tap on edit widget so let's just do that real quick tap on edit widget and from here you will be able to choose from the list which of the widgets you have saved you want to display on the home screen the next widget for the video is called countdown it allows you to have multiple countdowns on the home screen of your device so you can see right here we have a smaller one with just one countdown we have there a medium one with two different countdowns and you can create these by going into the app and you will have the emojis right here the display on the home screen you can see how cool they look now to create an event right here you can tap the plus button you can just go ahead and create a custom event from here and of course add the widgets you want to use right there or you can just tap right here it will take you to your calendar you will have all the different events you can go ahead and add any one of them from here next up is an app called noted now noted is really awesome it allows to send notes to your friends home screen the way you do that simply go ahead open the app and from here you will be able to actually tap the plus button and just send a note to one of your friends but of course first of all you will have to connect to that friend the way you do that once you open the app for the first time you will have a code right here the same will be with your friends as well when they open the app they will have a code all you have to do is just copy that code of your friend and just add it to the app right here then you will be able to simply send these to your friends and of course send and receive yours will be displayed on their home screen automatically theirs will be displayed on your home screen like this wink is the next app for the video this offers a pretty cool home screen widget it's kind of like the same like noted but actually no no nobody will actually send you like a writing or a painting like this but you will be able to actually do them yourself and add them to the home screen of your device you simply open the app and you can create here anything you want so of course you can change the color here of the pencil or whatever you're using here to write down you can change the color of the background of course anytime and once you have done that simply tap save and you will have your painting that you have done right here on the home screen so it is pretty cool it offers different sizes of widgets and of course you can have multiple of these paintings saved and then change them from here by editing the widget widget trivia is the next app for the video now this one is really cool i really enjoy this app now what it does it will actually show you different facts on the home screen of course these will be updated automatically and you can learn different things right on your home screen so you just add the widget and just go ahead take a look you will have different facts here that will be displayed and of course you can always learn something new now the app itself is also really cool you can open it and you will see right here different questions of course then you can go ahead and answer those and of course have them right here on the home screen as well next up is desk clock now this app offers a 
ton of different widgets which will display the clock on the home screen of your device you can see how cool these are that one with the car rim that's really really cool and you will have other ones like these here that actually look really really awesome and of course you can always have a widget here to display the time and look really cool let's just quickly go to the widget panel of this app going to the widgets panel you can see right here desk clock actually offers a lot of different clock designs for the home screen of your device and each of them actually look really really cool so you will have like eight or nine different clocks that you can add to the home screen of your device next up we have another clock widget this one is called clock widget that simple but it actually offers different designs for the home screen of your device and what's really cool and why i chose to add this app to the video is that it allows to actually customize these any way you like going into the app you can see right here we'll have the widgets you can of course choose any one of these and of course you can also go ahead and edit the widget and customize it any way you like so we'll have different colors here for the background of the widget or you can simply go ahead and choose any of the images that you have on your phone's library and of course add them as the background of the clock and of course you can choose the font right here we'll have different fonts to display and you can add like different stickers right there to the widget you can see how cool these look so you can create your own widget you will have a dark mode right here a light mode and color as well so pretty much design your own clock widget have it on the home screen even with the background being your photo that's pretty dope next up we have three different widgets from the widget app now these are the closest thing to interactive widgets and this is what i believe interactive widgets should be like on ios now these are pretty pretty cool of course i will leave them linked all right down below in the description of the video now this one right here you can see what we have we have the today's view right here showing our activity the news right there and the system data as well but of course i can tap right there on the agenda to move on to the calendar we have right here the calendar events we have the reminders as well or i can just go ahead and move to music you can see how cool that is and how good it works and right here we'll have a few extra so you will have the current weather you will have the battery percentage your steps and all that and it actually works so from here i can tap right there on the health data and of course you can see it will actually take me to the health app that's pretty pretty cool and if i tap right there one of the buttons you can see it will show me right here all the information regarding my device so the disc you see right there the creator and of course the release date right there and you can see it basically shows you the name of your device moving on we have another one this one is for the settings so what it does it actually allows to quickly have access to any of your settings so let's say I want to go ahead and open the Bluetooth settings I can just tap right there and it will open the Bluetooth settings now it works through shortcuts you will have to install the shortcut as well of course it will be linked right down below as well but it actually works and you can just go ahead and use this to actually go anywhere to your settings so software update of course it takes you to the software update page you can see how cool that is really really good and of course it works as it should should and last but not least we have this one right here i can see right here we have four different icons so we have the calendar we have the weather we have the settings right there and we have the health now what i can do right here let's say i want to display the weather i can tap the weather right there and you can see how the widget will actually change it turns into a bigger widget of course it will remove the, the, those other ones and will only display the weather tap right there again to close that tap right there on the calendar to show you the calendar events and the reminders as well you can see how cool this is this what interactive widgets should be like on ios and hopefully we'll get this with ios 16. so that's pretty much it for this video guys i hope you guys enjoyed the video and of course all these amazing widgets especially these interactive ones from widget they are really really cool so if you're interested on downloading any of these make sure you go ahead and check out the description of the video you will find all the links that you need right there again thank you guys for watching and i will see you on the next video